President Trump was right, Will. This is complete, uh, complete vindication for him. No collusion, no proof of a crime of obstruction, no Americans even indicted for anything Russia-related. I don't know how the left can possibly pretend to continue with their false narrative. Well, they're already shifting narratives. I mean, now they're running to obstruction, and uh, they're talking about the 10 points in here where Mueller pointed out there might be obstruction. Some of those are as ridiculous as Trump just firing uh, Comey, which is, again, these are things that we've already went over, we've debated. Obviously, the president can fire a subordinate. Um, that's part of his Article II powers. I think the worst thing in here, that if you were to look at it, it would be that him talking to uh, Don McGahn, who was to, uh, testified to Mueller, um, he, wanted, he didn't want Mueller to know that he wanted Mueller to be fired. I believe it was in the summer of 2017. That's pretty much the threshold. That might be the worst thing, and it's not even really that bad. But, I mean, there's nothing really in the report that was different from uh, uh, A.G. Barr's uh, summary. Um, oh, I'd, I'd like to add that no one in the country, in America, actually really cares that much about this report. They're very fatigued over this. This is just for journalists in D.C. to froth at the mouth about, to talk about. Um, I think this is therapy for a lot of uh, uh, people in the mainstream media like MSNBC and CNN. If you watched any of the news today, they were apoplectic. I, I haven't seen anything like it since Donald Trump won the election. Um, so that's really what it's all about. This is more for D the, the D.C. elites to kind of pat themselves on the back, try to rummage up some vindication rather than it is actual reporting or for the American people. Right. I've been surprised, I guess, that this is just self-centeredness. This is straight narcissism from the mainstream media who are saying this report uh, essentially proves that the mainstream media has gotten, has gotten their reporting correct over the last two years. Nothing could possibly be further from the truth. The mainstream media has told us for the past two years that President Trump was acting as a puppet of Vladimir Putin, that President Trump was guilty of crimes of conspiracy and perhaps even treason. None of that, none of that is true. Even the obstruction. I mean, if you read this report, this is not a friendly report to President Trump. There is politically damaging information in there, embarrassing information in there. Even so, Robert Mueller could not establish proof that in a crime of obstruction was committed. And he says himself that in order to meet the elements of obstruction as a crime, you have to prove the intent of the person was to act corruptly. Right. And he says, we've identified the intent uh, as not being conscious wrongdoing. He's identified the intent as being emotion, anger at being targeted by the left, by these phony things, because there was no underlying collusion. It's as if the mainstream media is completely ignoring that sentence. Right, and part of today's narrative is that A.G. Barr talked about Trump being frustrated when he brought up obstruction of justice, and they said, you know, he's working as, the Trump, as Trump's lawyer and not America's lawyer. Well, the reason he brought that up is to prove obstruction, you have to prove intent, that he wanted to obstruct justice of the underlying crime, but that's not what it was. It was Trump was trying to conduct foreign policy. He tried to get this message to Mueller during the investigation, and foreign leaders didn't know if he was going to be in office two months from now, three months from now. They weren't taking his offers or negotiations seriously because we really didn't know what was going to happen. So, I mean, that's why he was talking about Trump's intent was, was not to obstruct any of the justice. It was to get to work and to, you know, end this investigation as quickly as possible so he can do his job.